you know, a good example of a spider organization doing its job well is a, is a functional service provider that provides centralized service to people who willingly want to buy it. And they are responsible on the free market for their actions to the customer base. So if they mess up, the customers will go somewhere else. Now, where it gets tricky is when we have state monopolies that don't have competition. And I'm sure everybody would agree that the local post offices are, are a prime example of this. Uh, having been shipping books all around the world for the past three years, I, I'm, it's like, it's a nightmare. You know, like that's really, you don't feel like you are uh, the customer, the boss, as you should be. As you, you, you know, the entrepreneur should always be completely accountable to the customer. And if not, then the customer has the choice to go to somebody else who provides a better service. And this is the, you know, the basis of free market and how, how it should work. And state impedes that state prevents that from happening, uh, in lieu of, um, you know, mon kind of like this monopolies and oligopolies, uh, that channel funds from the before said cattle uh, to another pockets that are usually not in the service of the customer. It has nothing to do with customer service. If, if you have ever tried to get anything done with a state official, 